Hey Flame, I hear you have a lot to say about me when I'm not around. Wanna try it now, bitch? <laughs> lying? You can't even spell the word lying. What am I lying about? Huh, Flame, what am I lying about? You know what, by the time everybody is done kicking your fucking ass, that fucking ass of yours is gonna be slim, sassy, for real. You lying bitch telling everybody I'm jealous about you. Fucking hell, look at yourself. Give me a break. Oh, but you are jealous of me. You have to talk about me when I'm not even logged on. I live in your head rent free. Why? Because you're a weak, insignificant, jealous whore. You have to stick Tylenol bottles up your cunt to get attention. <laughs> and I never had to do that. So you don't like me very much. Don't worry. Stand in line, Eternal Flame. You're not the only one on Power Talk that doesn't like me. And every time I find out someone doesn't like me, my dick gets harder. Want to touch it? You fucking moron. Hey, Eternal Flame, you're kicking her ass. She does things offline. She does things in private, okay? Kick her ass. I want to hear you beat that bitch. I love hearing you key up there, Eternal Flame. Beat that bitch's ass. She's just feeling fucking guilty because I know the fucking truth about her. Oops. That wasn't very nice to daughter. Um, what's the truth then? If you know the truth about me, why don't you tell it? I'd like to hear it. Why are you dotting her, hottie? Why are you dotting her? Let them fucking fight, you stupid bitch. You dotted her, stupid bitch. Because I watch. I got a hat like you do, bitch. Making a cut and paste. Punk will see the goddamn notifier. Sorry, sassy, but, you know, this is the way these people operate in here. Go ahead. Commence to beating her eternal. Her ass is already marked. For real. She's nasty and a fucking disgrace to fucking pal talk. I don't even know why you come in here, sassy gal. For real. You can't get it anywhere else now. Now you, now you come in here. Trying to fucking play these men. Fucking player. <laughs> Don't hate the player, hate the game. Or is that the other way around? I'm not quite sure. <laughs> I'm such a player that I can't even fucking remember it. But you know, one thing I never had to do in Turtle <laughs> was I never had to hit on reinstations. I mean, you hit on a man who eats his own poop. <laughs> I can understand why you hate me. I seriously can. Bitch, get your facts straight. I didn't even meet him. He's the one that wanted to see me and I fucking dissed him. For real, who in the fuck is gonna get along with the fucking shit eater? Only you, Sassy. For real. That's why you were spending your time in there, because you wanted to get to know him better. Stupid ass. Do you think that sticking the two words for real in between each sentence is actually going to make people believe what you're saying is true? You came into the room after the day that he was supposed to meet you and you were crying. You literally had a go at him because he stood you up. You said I was standing there waiting and you didn't turn up. <laughs> And we all pointed and laughed at you. And you can't handle it. Aw, pop it. So you focus on me. Like I said, I don't blame you for you being jealous and hateful towards me. Because if I were you, I'd be the same way towards me. Because why? I'm fucking awesome. And you know it. No, you're fucking fat and wide in the hips, bitch. Get your fucking facts straight telling these fucking men you're fucking all that when we know you're not. <laughs> yeah, I can laugh it out now, bitch. I didn't tell them shit, they know. <laughs> Look at you, you're so upset over a chick on the internet. Hey, Ellie Turner, why do you care who I hit on and who I speak to and who I fuck? I mean, it's not like I'm your husband, right? Why don't you go and take care of your husband and your marriage and leave me be who I am? Oh, that's right. Because you're not happily married. You're another one of these lame fuckers who's in a bad marriage and is too scared to do what I did and walk away. You sad sorry bitch.
<laughs> Bitch, again. Again, you're fucking lying to these people. You didn't walk away. Your fucking husband fucking slapped you and fucking beat you up. He got you out that fucking house fast, didn't he? You slut. He fucking found out what a big whore you are. <laughs> if that's what helps you sleep at night, then you go ahead and believe it. But we know what's true, don't we, Eternal Flame? You hate me because I'm I'm doing something that you wish you could do, but you don't have the bollocks to do it. You know what? One of your power men called your husband and, and was telling him how much of a whore you are online. That's why he fucking left you. Because you're no good. I have it going on here. That's all I'm saying. Oh, you're bringing up Gator, something that happened like seven years ago. Wow. That's news. Ooh, wow. No one knows about that, Eternal. Please don't expose me. Yeah. No one has ever actually heard that. You know what, Sassy? For you to know, ain't no man here wants a fucking big girl. Like yourself, you fat ass bitch. Is that supposed to make me stop sleeping tonight? Or am I supposed to melt down now and cry? I mean, what's the reaction that you're looking for, Eternal Flame? Because obviously my presence and who I am bothers you to the core. That you have to come up with childish, stupid, ridiculous sayings like, Sassy, no one wants you. You're unfuckable. Motherfucker, don't be so daft. I give one of these guys enough to drink or enough weed and they'll fuck the shit out of me. Because they don't care. They're men. Grow up, dummy. King, yeah, she'll let you hit on that because you have no fucking teeth, old bastard. You tell him, Sassy. You ain't above you in a roofie. Shut the fuck up their spark plug fingers. Look who comes into the room at 5.42 in the morning, throwing his two cents worth of Mr. Crybaby Snitch Blade. That's what do you keep dotting me for there, fucking bitch? Jesus. 5.42 where you're at. 6.42 here, fuck chops. That's right, Switchblade. <laughs> If the roofie doesn't work, I'll tie that motherfucker up and ride him till there's no tomorrow. <laughs> Either way, I'm getting mine. Bitch, you'll fucking kill the fucking guy, fat ass. Hey, Sassy, why did you invite your new boyfriend conflict over? You want that fucking ass tapped, you fucking whore? Look at how you watch me and every single move I do and every breath I take. <laughs> <laughs> Can someone say stalker? Oh my god. Yes, I invited him to DSA because I thought we could have sex in this room instead of having sex in Apple Inc. Because people have sex on the net, right? What a dummy. You, you know what? You listen to Pal Talk way too closely and you watch what I do way too much. You're kind of scary. You can't stand the truth, can you? You fucking bitch. Laugh it out. Because that's all you are. He's a fucking joke. Yeah, bitch, I already know the truth. What, what I want to know is where Smoke88 is right now, bitch. What the fuck you did to him? Because I haven't seen him ever since, bitch. You did something to the guy. You have him pussy whipped. He can't even come online. Damn shame. <laughs> okay, I confess. I chopped him up, put him in the freezer, and I've been eating him for the last year and a half. <laughs> Every day I take a little bit out and I cook it. And he's absolutely delicious. Yeah, she's kind of right about that. Whatever happened to Smoke 88? I remember him and you used to have your pal talk fantasies with each other. Okay. Yeah, what happened? Pipe took his computer away from him. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. Smoke was pussy whipped way before Sassy ever come along. Way before. Still is. Man, that's bullshit. Smoke is fucking hiding from her from day one. 
He doesn't want anything to do with that fucking freak. That's right, Eternal. You've got me all pegged. He is hiding. In fact, he's probably in this room right now, hiding and not saying a word or typing. I totally agree. <laughs> you know what the funny thing is about me, Eternal Flame? That I can be whatever you want in your mind because it doesn't matter. All right, sweetie. You know what he told me that day? He was like, I'd rather be with you than anybody else. That's what he told me. He is like so sweet. Sassy, it's understandable, sweetie. It's okay you're jealous of me because of Smoke meeting me and not you. It's okay. I, I know. You're just mad 